In this video, I'd like to show you how to break the link between one or more components in a pattern. I have a circular pattern here where this one is the original and the rest pattern off of it. What I want to do is show you how to break the link of any one of these or two or three from the pattern make them unique. Let's get started. So I'm going to decide which one I want to do. I want to do this one which is number three. So the first thing I'm going to do is go up under Create, pick on Boundary Fill, pick on the component I want, which I've already selected it. I'll do it again. Then select the cell and this will give you a unique body or component. I want a new component. I want to keep the tool because if I deleted this method, it would erase the pattern, all the rest in it. Say OK, and you'll see now I have a component, but also number three is still there. You can right click on it and remove it. Now this component is no longer bound by the joints of the assembly, which must be added later back into the assembly, but that's not my topic. Let me prove to you that this is unique from the rest. Let's make a quick modification to this component. I'll activate it and I'm going to add two fillets to the back wall to each corner. Say OK and return to the top level. You'll notice that all the rest of them do not have the fillet so this one is unique. This same process can be used if you copy and paste a component and later need to break the link. It would be the same thing as if you copied and pasted new. I hope this helped you do better work in Fusion 360.